This is Fox 59 Live at 5. And new right now Live at 5. The search is on for these men you see on your screens. They are suspects in a smash and grab. They're on their way into two jewelry stores there in Indianapolis. They have now gotten away with thousands of dollars in jewelry and police want to catch them before they hit again. It is the big story. It is still developing. Obviously, thanks so much for joining us live at five. I'm Fanchon Stinger and I'm Dan Spieler tonight. Fox 59's Alexis Adams is at Castleton Square Mall to show us more about this case. Alexis. Investigators tell me those two men walked into this K Jewelers here at Castleton and threatened the employees. Then one pulled out a hammer and started smashing the counter. Caught on camera. Two individuals uh, kind of came in in a, in a brazen act. Police say these guys stole more than $150,000 worth of merchandise from 2K jewelry stores around Indianapolis. They did not cover their faces. Uh, they just kind of walked in uh, very quickly, didn't make any attempts to um, conceal their identity. Last week, investigators say the duo hit this K jewelers at Castleton Square Mall. Police say one man jumped over the counter and forced the employees on the floor while the other one went to work with the hammer. Their main focus was on the cases that were out front. Detectives tell me it only took a few seconds for those guys to take the hammer and smash through the glass. Quickly grabbed as much jewelry as possible and then they looked through the store uh, for a few minutes before fleeing on foot and were able to escape. Investigators tell me those men grabbed so much stuff they dropped rings and jewels all over the floor when they ran out. We believe it is the same individual or individuals that were involved in the robbery at the K Jewelers on East Washington Street from last May. In that case, they stole more than $100,000 in merchandise at one time. Tonight, police trying to track those men down before they strike again. It's not outside the realm of possibility that these folks are probably dabbling in some other kind of criminal activity where they may use the jewelry stolen from the robbery to either fund, you know, different criminal activities that they may be involved in. Tonight, as detectives take a closer look at the surveillance video, they're hoping someone recognizes these guys and calls Crime Stoppers with the tip that could crack this case. Reporting tonight at Castleton Square Mall, I'm Alexis McAdams. Back to you. Alexis, thank you. IMPD thinks these.